good morning you lovely people welcome to the channel yesterday was one year after johnny depp versus ah trial began we know what happened the first of june also which is probably the more important date if you ask me uh, i remember that very well it was also my birthday yesterday something incredible happened i just saw a little part of the live stream of uh, popcorn planet which put together a lot of people a lot of youtubers which uh, participated in the depth trial uh youtube lawyers and so on and so forth including ex-wife of johnny depp but the most important thing they did which honestly hat off to everybody involved to popcorn planet to pull this off is they did the whole live stream for charity for the make a wish foundation and they raised more than sixty thousand dollars in seven hours I mean I'm honestly speechless that's absolutely fantastic and uh, shows again the power that you know when people come together for good things and especially when you remember that a certain person didn't give money to children uh, it's just astonishing wow wow 60 plus thousand in seven hours incredible uh, anyway congratulations guys really amazing and they also interviewed uh, Johnny Depp's first wife, which um, she spoke uh, about Amber H and other things. So we're just going to go through here through the article, which I found uh, on the mirror, which I find quite interesting. Uh, Laurie Ellison has lashed out uh, Amber H in a rare interview, who was married to the Pirates of the Caribbean from uh, 1983 to 1985, labeled Amber 36 horrific in the outburst. Uh, the comment on Johnny 16 Amber highly publicized defamation trial. All right. Uh, makeup artist Laurie had previously kept quiet on the case. However, while speaking on Popcorn Planet, she rolled her eyes when asked about the pair. I've been to parties at his house and she seemed really nice and she was gorgeous and what not to love. But as the time went by, I will hear things about her. She will, shall not be named. He didn't seem too happy all the time. I didn't see him a lot, so I can't really say. Uh, she continued, the thing that affected me more were the thing uh, he said in court. Probably I broke down several times because I felt really bad for him. He's a very private person, which is why I don't do interviews. Um, which why? Which is why I don't do interviews. Okay. I think for him to come out so or haltedly was uh, w what was what he really needed to do i apologize and she claimed that what she thought about amber h had done was absolutely horrific laurie confessed she thought the case would either go really well for her ex-husband or an epic train wreck she went on to talk about isaac barouche who is one of johnny's closest friend she claimed she would often call him and ask how johnny was doing but was always told don't worry we're going to win this Laurie, Laurie later gushed over her ex, labeling him really generous and claiming he has the biggest heart of someone I've ever met. Oh, but we have no doubt that Johnny is really an amazing guy. I mean, we're really talking about decades of people working with this guy and people always say the same thing. It's, you know, private, most likely could be also a shy person, even though he's a superstar, super megastar. And uh, there is consistency there. The same way there is a consistency in the other way around for AH. Amber and Johnny case started in 2016. But anyway, so this is quite remarkable also that they managed to interview her. And um, not that we needed any more, let's say, uh, uh, validation or uh, <laughs> confirmation, so to speak. This is an article that came on People Magazine here talking about the post trial. And let's scroll right here. She has been living in Spain where she gets more privacy. The article is talking about AH. The trial was beyond stressful for her. She just wanted to start fresh out of the country. The source say, we don't know the source. She is excited about working and filming again. She was exhausted and disappointed about the trial. She felt she was mistreated. The source added, this is all behind her now though she has new energy and is focusing on things that she loves oh boy i love how the main well not love but 
it's amusing to see how the mainstream media is still in a more or less this article is kind of uh you know averagely unbiased but they still try to squeeze in you know like let's say the the side of a h nobody's buying this shit anymore you know she defamed the she defamed him with actual malice end of the story uh johnny depp 59 has been focusing on work and inside the close to the actor says last year Depp toured with Jeff Beck rest his soul unfortunately passed away now the new movie is coming out uh, Jean de Bury uh, uh, directed by Maiwen which he also stars in the movie so Johnny's been living in Europe since the trial and uh, they say he's been dating but doesn't have a girlfriend we don't know if this is true we know that Johnny Depp is rumored to have bought a property um, in uh, in England. Let's see if I can see right here. It's supposed to be this property right there. And uh, also a pub. There is a rumor of a pub that he wants to buy. Looks great. The, actually, the, the new movie looks great. I don't know if I can see right here. This is supposed to be the pub. At the moment, I don't know. We'll see if this is just another rumor, but more uh, outlets are reporting on this. It's, they say that this is a pub that is supposed to be close to him, that he has some memories there. Uh, apparently worth around a million pound. That's a lot for a small property like that. But then again, I'm not surprised those type of prices in the UK. That's a nice, uh, nice little village. Um, and... Uh, it's also interesting the mansion the mansion is beautiful man if it, this is really the house that he has absolutely gorgeous place look at that so guys there you have it still hard at work the pr of somebody that cannot be named trying to rectify the the, the past which is not possible because we also what we saw and again congratulations to popcorn planet and everybody involved yesterday for an incredible stream reaching sixty thousand plus dollars for charity for make a wish foundation wow really absolutely fantastic guys anyway let me know your thoughts on this please consider subscribing i'll talk to you later